good evening wherever you are on this uh, most pleasant evening there has been a clamor to get inside the ground tonight for a much anticipated game the uh, roads outside of the stadium have been bumper to bumper with traffic the car parks are full there is a torrent of humankind making its way from the nearby station and we expect every seat to be filled an atmosphere of uh, great expectation and excitement well this really is a great venue it adds so much character to every game it stages the czech republic braced for their anthem The Czech Republic have gone with a 4-5-1 gym. Well, if you want to secure a clean sheet, Peter, this is a very good way of going about it. It adds discipline and lends a stubbornness to that midfield, which can stifle opposition attempts to, to play through, and it takes a lot of pressure off your defence, of course. Forces longer passes through the aerial route. So, all things considered, that extra layer across midfield is highly, highly effective. So off we go then. That's oh, good intervention. Things could have got far worse than that. to get it forward quickly he's gone for it good try the outcome could so easily have been different his reputation is better than what we've just seen Whistle's gone, that's a foul. It's on a plate, has a hit! Forward it goes. Barida. Played out to the right. Gets it into the middle. Towering header! Goal! The Czech Republic! And it's the Czech Republic who take the lead! That is a fine goal, really efficiently done. Yeah, I just thought he wanted that more than anyone else on the pitch, and it was fully deserved. He gave it everything he had. The Czech Republic have an early lead. Good start. Great strength, too strong for his opponent. It's been intercepted, and that will come to nothing.
Looking for a decent ball here. Great lead! He has done it! All too easy! They are in danger of disappearing out of sight! Oh, the cross was inch perfect, and the header unerring. Well, as contact goes, that was tremendous, and it helped him to direct it exactly where he wanted into that net. I think when it comes to the aerial department, this fella is definitely no slouch. So that's two now without reply. Well, it's been a, an absolutely fabulous spell for them, and they're starting to look unstoppable. There could be more on the way. Well, the ball's come loose, and the chase is on. Ball's out on the left now. Good run, ultimately thwarted by an astute piece of defending. Crowd appreciates good football all round there. Gets away from his opponents. Hits one! It's there! Back to within one! Interesting! The lightness of step, the sharpness of movement, the certainty of finish. Well, none of us were exactly sure how that was going to end up then, but I'm delighted to see such a, a happy ending after such a splendid dribbling run. I mean, he really did fool that defence into wondering what he was going to do next. This is threatening to become a really good game. Well, it was important they didn't get ahead of themselves and lose their discipline. This game plan could near well reward them with an equaliser. And he's got the ball glued to his feet. There are a few waiting for it. Up to meet it! Oh, just couldn't turn it in. I have to commend the wing plate, but I have to condemn the defending. They've got to stop the cross. Loses his balance and loses the ball. And it's played forward. Cuts it out. Barida. Schick. Can he deliver? Hit it. Gets his head to it! Another header, but again the same outcome. The Czech Republic are literally using their heads with some very good service, but it's time for someone to add authority. Gets it back. A mixture of good defending and indecisive passing. No progress. wrestled off the ball and that's one way of trying to make things happen there's a few who could follow that example hoists it forward well that's where he wants it the Czech Republic are in control here on the brink of half time so who's he picking out in for a header Another fruitless header. The Czech Republic might just feel they're onto something here despite not pulling that away, you know. Board pass. It's gone out for a throw in.
Oh, he's not going to get that. Oh, we hit half time. So a really good half of football. Three goals and just one separating them. It's kind of a hard one to call, Peter, isn't it? I mean, from what we've seen so far, both sides have provided ample evidence that they can add more goals, and I'm sure their respective managers have reminded them that the next one will be pretty crucial. So it's going to be interesting to see how the teams come out for the next period. Well, it remains very delicately poised, and based on the, the promise we've seen through the first 45 minutes, I wouldn't be surprised if this takes another twist or two. It certainly would be in keeping. The Czech Republic head into the half-time break with a narrow lead, two goals to one. And we're off again. Forward it goes. Yeah, it looks like a, a change of approach and it may just freshen things up. Oh, sweet feet. A chance to play. Gets up to hit it! Schick gets flagged offside. Keeper sends it forward. Tries to get it forward quickly. And it's played forward. Could move up a gear here. And it's Krejci. He is not one readily to admit defeat. Don't be surprised if he tries that again. Tries to get it forward quickly. And that's been won straight back. And it's played forward. And he's made sure that that won't get through. Can't get the better of his opposite number. It's a very good battle there, terrific to watch. Well, we don't need to guess that they expect plenty of, of ball into the box. Yeah, it's quite a crowd scene in the middle now. Well, it's a situation that requires resilience now and, and plenty of fighting spirit. It has to be matched. Well, the defence got the better of him this time, but I'm sure he'll go again. Krejci. Gorgeous control there. And play for a throw. Plays it out to the flank. Now, can shoots! Good enough. Schick looking as though he's being given special treatment here. Treatment he could well do without. Yeah, and getting on the score sheet has clearly made him a marked man now. More than happy to take the muscular approach. Tries to locate someone up front. Done very well to intervene. Berida. Schick, pings it out wide. Lovely bit of skill. Kret hits it first time! Schick. Oh, goes for goal! And that's caused a 
a worry or two. Well, the look on his face says it all. Hoists it forward. Well played, he saw that coming. Keep calm and carry on. That's the job in a nutshell now. Forward it goes. Peter, they have to fight the onset of desperation and keep enough cool heads to still deliver. Hoists it forward. Keep calm and carry on. That's the job in a nutshell now. That's a good foot in there. Whistle's gone, that's a uh, foul. Oh, that's a booking, always looked it. Well, the protest continues, but in the end, they are defending the indefensible. So he's plotting something before playing it in. The Czech Republic are clearly looking to kill this game off. It's keeping the ball away from the other end too. Late towards the front then. Has he found his man? Garida. He's in! Chance! The Czech Republic can afford to settle on seeing this one out by running down the clock, I think. Plays it out to the wing. Kreci. Goes for the cross. But that is good defending. It's been repelled. Oh, that is asking for trouble. Plenty waiting in the middle. without complication. And that is that. The Czech Republic winners by the odd goal. It really could have gone either way, but a win is a win. Your final thoughts, Jim? The Czech Republic showed us why it's so important to seize the initiative. Once in front, they grew in belief and, and rarely looked at risk. So many thanks to Jim Beglin. That's all we have time for. Good evening to you.